what, what for me is, uh, is essential looking to the future is about the latest technology that helps to rotate a company to become digital. And uh, specific technology are for me all the IMAX, interactive, mobility, analytics, cloud and security, which we can say is the new, but as well there is the new new with AI, artificial intelligence, blockchain, and immersive reality or extended reality. Those are the specific technology that we are implementing as we speak. What I think they are all very important because then every client will have a specific need and we're going to use some of those technology. But what we see, uh, one being absolutely strategic as we speak, is artificial intelligence. Not only because of the value it can bring to a company, but as well as the risk to be managed, whether you're going to do it right or you're going to do it wrong, because it can have a massive impact to your employees. So you need, when you implement it as well, to transform your workforce to be able to work in the new, because some tasks are going to be automated, uh, whether they are maybe a, a simple task or more complex tasks, so you're going to have to rotate your employees. So for me, artificial intelligence makes the, the, the biggest impact uh, as we speak, as we transform uh, a large company in the world. Um, so we're here today to, uh, to engage with clients, to engage with partners, to engage with the ecosystem and show, show the new. It's not about talking about it, it's about showing the new. So we bring experts around the various theme of the Technology Vision 2018, uh, where we talk about AI, where we talk about uh, data veracity, where we talk about uh, extended reality or the, uh, the ecosystem. Uh, that needs to be uh, to, to, to be connected with in a frictionless type of, uh, of, of model, and um, those themes are, are, are the themes that help us to engage with, with clients because they, that resonates pretty well. So we are bringing uh, the tech vision and our, our view in a, in a concrete world today, talking with the different clients around. That's why we're here, and uh, we wanted to partner with Bloomberg as well because it's their first uh, uh, sooner than you think event, and it's always good to be the first jointly, so that's also a good reason to be here. I really liked uh, Carlos Gonch when he talked about uh, his company uh, pushing away. I, I'm not looking to any integration type of things. I'm really looking, focusing on the new with the autonomous car, electrical car, what people are going to do within the car. That, that, that's really his interest. And I heard about a few dozens, like around $50 billion is going to invest in the new cars and all the things that goes around. That was very visionary. And I, and I think he has demonstrated in the past his ability to execute things as well. So very uh, energetic uh, presentation. And as well, uh, Jürgen from Nine Cents, who talked about machine learning and AI, because it's, uh, it's going to happen sooner than, than we think, right? So uh, those, those two were particular. And of course, but I should not mention it, but of course, Pierre Nanterme yesterday was, was of course a great story because he talked about Accenture experience, but as well, how's, how do we do that for the large company in the world, applying as well what we did for ourselves. Yeah, of course, there is, there is many things that keep us awake at night, but we try to you know, cool down and relax because uh, of course, it's happening quick, but we have to do it right. If you just think, for example, about data, we talk in the tech vision about the data veracity. Data veracity is more about moving from quantity, you know, I, I, I'm going to collect all the data I can, and then I will see later what I'm going to do. No, it's about the data quality. You need to ensure you, you, you're going to put in your AI system the right data, you're going to use in your decision-making process the right data, because then that will trigger investment. You know, and sometimes decisions can be even made automatically based on data. So you can put your business at risk if you don't address the data veracity uh, correctly in your company.